once you know. Good morning, team. Thanks for checking in for the next Kilograms Kilometers podcast. And today is about the uh, the known uh, or easily known secret to superstars. Uh, you know, a lot of folks see uh, see top athletes or you know successful individuals who you know maybe break away, uh, go into a new. Uh, a new circle, a new discipline, maybe even a new sport, and find success. And you think, man, like the people like that are so unique uh, that they can be successful or be talented at different things. Uh, but the reality is, that's the same for anybody, for any of us. Is that once you understand the secret, once you understand the process, the recipe, then you just repeat it uh, in those different environments with those different skills. So. Um, you know, say for example, you're uh, you're you're changing sports. Um, you know, maybe you're going from a throwing sport to a, a kicking sport or something of that nature. Uh, maybe it's just you know still a throwing sport, but different uh, different techniques. Uh, you know, it's just hypothetically, right? Maybe baseball, lacrosse, or vice versa, something of that nature. You're used to kind of you know swinging. Uh, something, but it's going to be a different type of swing, a different style of swing, that sort of thing. Uh, you know, in terms of working out or training, different kinds of running. All right. So if you're a sprinter, um, you know, or more of a speed individual, and now you're going to more distance, right? That running cadence is going to be different. The running technique, posture, etc. So this the recipe is the same, right? You you break down the skill into different components. Let's say if you are doing distance running. Not only is it stride mechanics, but it's stride frequency, it's tempo, it's uh, rhythm, you know, it's managing your your splits or your paces, that sort of thing. And, and so dedicating uh, each session or each day to a different skill, all right? So maybe one day is just your tempo, you're focused on your pace. The next day you're focused on your stride, uh, how, you know, stride frequency. So you're just trying to keep a tempo. Uh, and then another day you're... Uh, you really focus on the capacity, on the the endurance, and just let's get in as many miles as we can. So, so that's the secret, right? Um, you know, again, this week we're talking about that transition with uh, with sporting or, or fitness uh, ventures. Uh, but again, the same goes anywhere else. Even if you're starting to apply yourself into business or the work environment, that's completely. Uh, very similar, right? You break down that job into the different skills and uh, just dedicate time to sharpening yourself or sharpening your, your skills in that area. So uh, not to get too philosophical, but uh, you know, if you are looking for a change like that, or if you're in that process uh, and you're curious about how to break it down so you can be more focused, hit us up, let us know send us a DM, a direct message at at Universal Sports Strength on social media. Love to connect. Help build a plan, build a game plan, build a process to help you improve on whatever new venture it is that you're pursuing. So on the second half of the week, let's keep it going strong and let's keep working.